Hi guys. <clears throat> it is now uh, about one o'clock in the afternoon of <clears throat> the single hottest, most miserable wet bulb day of the year in the Finger Lakes of New York, baby, where it is Tuesday, July 9th. It is just now coming up on one o'clock in the afternoon. They were saying this morning the high today was going to be 90, which was a joke. It's not even 1 o'clock. It is 94 degrees with uh, a heat index of 100. So I guess we're kind of in triple digits here in upstate New York today. Uh, good Lord, I... <clears throat> I'm thinking this, is this the single hottest, most miserable day I have ever endured in the state of New York? Uh, there might have been, uh, in, in, what am I, 20, 21, I'm uh, going on, I'm in the middle of my fifth summer here maybe one or two days this miserable, but uh, I hear some rumors since I'm no longer doom scrolling. <coughs> I hear some rumors of the remnants of a hurricane blowing in here. Uh, tomorrow, so uh, I'm hoping that'll be the end of this, and as you can see, there's actually, <coughs> just in the last three minutes, unbelievably, we have a breeze blowing, <coughs> summer breeze is blowing around the 100 degree <coughs> heat, so, uh, <coughs> Anyway, uh, I, I, I just had to remark on this email I just received from this fellow. Never met him, Billy Bob, <clears throat> who is a fairly regular commentator on my channels, and I don't know how many others uh, he comments on in the Doomosphere. I uh, don't know the man. That he seems like a you know a perfectly nice guy you know the little bit I know of him, but it's just the latest example <clears throat> of whenever I do a whine about not being able to find a woman. Uh, I was over on that other channel and I mentioned uh, on there that I, you know, I have accepted, I have radically accepted the fact that I am going to be alone for the rest of my life, uh, that I will never find a woman uh, from now until the day I die. Uh, there is no woman on this planet that a, has any interest in being with me, and then, of course, uh, if there was a woman like that that showed up, I, I, I mean, of course, I would have to be interested in, in spending the rest of my life with her, <clears throat> but it's more the first. It's a lot more the first part of that equation than the second. <clears throat> So I, 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 every time I mention this, that uh, I'm never going to have a woman in my life again, invariably, uh, I will get an email, a phone call or something. You, you very rarely are going to hear this. Come on, dog. Are you coming in or not? Sancho, come on now. Come on, little dog. Too hot out there. Why don't you go hide under the bed in there? Oh man. 
Sancho is retreating under the bed in the hummingbird tiny house to get out of this miserable heat. So anyway, it's, it's whenever I mention this that I'm never going to have a woman in my life, uh, I will hear from some very well-intentioned man. And, and I'm not talking some, and, and I'm not talking incels, or probably, if I knew this fellow who just sent me this email, probably the vast majority of people would not even consider them misogynist. This average guy's trying to help out another guy, pointing out, <clears throat> as this nice man was doing, as, as if I had never considered this, that, that what are you talking about? That you'll never have a woman again. That they're for sale all over the planet, basically. That there are, that, that any time you want a woman, uh, you, you can go out and, uh, and, and throw down a few dollars uh, and you will have a woman for anywhere from 10 minutes to an hour in your life. And they just automatically default. I'm a 64-year-old man. They automatically go into the default. <clears throat> when they hear the word woman, when I say the word woman, okay, or maybe I'll have to go back and listen to my, listen to my rant again. When I say the word woman, what they hear is pussy. That's what they hear. One man says, I will never have another woman in my life again. And all the other men, <clears throat> just nice, normal men, hear me saying, I will never have pussy again in my entire life. And they say, dude, uh, you can have pussy any uh, day or night you want it. Go out and buy you some fucking pussy. And stop your bitching and, and, and whining. What do you mean you, you don't have a woman in your life? Uh, there's pussy for sale all over this planet. It's the world's oldest profession. End of problem. And, uh, you know, the, the ironic thing about this is, uh, you know, with, with my performance art, uh, as I was reminded recently uh, by the Gnat of Doom, uh, I am a well-known misogynist, that I am a, a woman-hating, sexist, misogynist pig. And, uh, <laughs> and every time I mention uh, not being able to find a woman, uh, all of these guys, as I say, usually in a private, in a private forum, uh, you know, sounding like uh, women-hating, uh, misogynist, male chauvinist pigs, not understanding the difference uh, in the definition of the word woman and the definition of the word pussy. <clears throat> that a, a man hears another man say the word woman and they hear the word pussy. That, that what women are is that they're just, I, I guess what women are, according to these guys, they're just free-floating vaginas uh, that, that's not attached to, to the rest of a, uh, of a human being. There is one body part that, uh, that, that they hear. Uh, for, for the record, <clears throat> well, Okay, I will put an asterisk. I have probably in my entire life gotten four lap dances at uh, at strip joints in my in my younger days. Uh, I I have had probably in my life four lap dances, not counting uh, those four. I have never one time in my entire life. Uh, paid uh, for pussy. I've never done it. The uh, it is, I, I have no interest in paying for pussy. 
uh, j j just the, the, the thought of paying for pussy it is it I, I mean it just you know I'm not gonna be a real prude uh, I'm not gonna say it disgusts me uh, I guess if, 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 if you're two consenting adults you're a woman with a pussy for sale and, and you're a man wanting to buy a pussy uh, I 100% I, I uh, defend two consenting adults one with a pussy one in the market for someone with a pussy making a business transaction doing what they need to do uh, in, in 20 or 30 minutes and going on about their separate ways <clears throat> I, I, I you know I, I I'm, I'm totally okay with two consenting adults doing that I have zero interest in paying for pussy <clears throat> and, and I think I, I, I'm probably deluding myself, but if, if, if my goal, if, 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 if my one and only goal in my search for a life partner for my doomer chick forever what, what was looking for a warm, wet hole to stick my dick into, even I, okay, even a, 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 a bitter uh, old man with broken teeth, stranded, out, stranded without love, uh, you know, living out in, in the middle of West Bumblefuck or East Bumblefuck, wherever it is I live, even I, <clears throat> without paying for it, I could probably, if my sole intention what was to find a warm, wet hole to stick my dick in, uh, I, I, I could find one. Okay? If, if, if that was my intention. Now, probably the ones, uh, I admit, that would be available to me, the, the warm, wet holes that would be available to me, would be surrounded, you know, by some... A blob of, of of adipose tissue, and uh, I, I would have no desire. Oops, I thought these uh, these people, these kids, were on uh, were in Ithaca. So good thing I. Did you manage to get your bike fixed? No, nope. sorry about that, brother. I uh, I went and looked for a pair of pliers, but it was hopeless. <clears throat> That's all right. Thank you for trying. <laughs> but there's uh, plenty of places in Ithaca to buy a cheap pair of pliers. <clears throat> yeah. So you guys heading out on this hot day? Uh, it's after one o'clock. Yeah. All right. Well, you, I guess you can still put it. It's 94 degrees. Feels like 100. Oh, boy. <laughs> this is, you managed to be here dude, on the hottest day of the entire year. I think it might be the hottest day I have ever had here. And this is my fifth summer. I think this is the hottest day uh, ever in, uh, in Ithaca, New York. You managed to hit it. Yes. Oh yeah, did just leave that. Uh, I I have the drip irrigation going, so I I'll, I'll get those. Don't worry about it. Yeah, don't worry about it. I I need to let this run. You you guys go ahead and enjoy your day, and I will take care of those and just set them there on the side. <laughs> And grabbing grabbing some ice out of the freezer. Yep. <clears throat> there you go. Grab all the ice packs you can while you still can. Oh all, right. all right. Good luck in finding a swimming hole. Thank you. <laughs> See ya. I mean, these real nice kids, and, and I do mean, do mean kids. 
they 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 look to me like they're still teenagers. Uh, these uh, poor kids. Uh, they drove up here from Maryland, trying to get out of the heat in Maryland, and uh, drove like ten hours uh, to to get the hell out of out of Maryland, and thinking Ithaca, New York, that the Finger Lakes sounded like a nice place to escape the heat, and uh, here they are. <coughs> but anyway. Uh, these young kids, they are so much in love. You know, to be 19 and in love. Oh, Jesus. What the hell do these 19-year-old lovers have in store for them? Uh, God, being 19 and in love and, and having your choice uh, of these beautiful uh, young women. Oh God, how depressing. Uh, but anyway, so so guys, I I, I just want to say to 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 you, if you ever hear me whining uh, about not being able to find a woman in my life, okay. I, I'm talking about a, an entire collection of body parts uh, from the top of her head to the bottom of her feet, uh, preferably one uh, with a brain in her head. Uh, it's, it really is disturbing. Uh, apparently, how a 60-year-old man it, 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 it hears me using the word woman and, and, and thinks I'm talking about pussy. Just, 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 just completely clueless, obviously. Oh, Jesus. What is a woman-hating, misogynist, uh, male chauvinist pig, incel, whatever else I've been called, I'm going to do... <laughs> But right now, uh, what I'm going to do, well, after my drip irrigation finishes, I'm going to go hose down all of my uh, impatience, and I guess I'm going to uh, get in my gas-sucking truck with the ice-cold air conditioner and, and just drive around like I did uh, two days ago, just, just, just drive around blowing fossil fuels out my ass, uh, listening to music, and uh, enjoying the ice-cold air conditioner blasting on my face while I still can. Get out there and enjoy the uh, ice-cold air conditioner blowing on your face while you still can. Yes, little dog, are you just... I thought, why aren't you under the bed where it's nice and cool under there, little dog? Uh, I'm back to the hothouse earth. Bye, guys.